video. Today we're wait. What's that? Ah! <laughs> nope. This is my video project. Now that he's gone, let's get started. So in today's video, we'll be going over the five sentence types. The first one we'll be talking about is a prepositional phrase. So a prepositional phrase is a group of words containing a preposition and a noun or a pronoun. Hey, Matthew, why don't you show us how you move around the map? Sure thing. Let me get into position. So as you can see, Matthew grapples across the map. We can now mark prepositional phrases off the list. Next up, we're going into we're going to activate our supers, which will tie into a gerund phrase. A gerund phrase is a verb plus ing with a noun. So when I say go, we are going to pop our supers. All right. Mm -hmm. Go. <laughs> Personally, I believe activating your super is so satisfying. The build-up to it is what makes it cool. Don't you agree? Yeah, but I wish I didn't die. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> Next up, we have an appositive phrase. An appositive phrase is a group of words in a sentence that gives extra information about a noun or pronoun. It is also set off by commas. Currently, I'm on the moon, defeating low-level enemies, so I can build super energy. As guardians, we gotta stay powerful at all times. Oop, that's an anti-barrier. Two hours later. My guardian, a god slaying machine, decimates a group of enemies. Next, we have a participial phrase. In this segment, we'll be using par past participial phrases. Past participials are verbs that also use past tense endings, like ED. Alright Matt, now comes the fun part. Let's go take down those enemies over there and then celebrate. Yes sir! His enemies, Matt emotes joyfully. Yo, wasn't that awesome guys? I thought it was pretty epic. Finally. We made it to the last portion of today's video. Our final phrase type we will be going over today will be an infinitive phrase. An infinitive phrase usually functions as a noun or a subject while also using to and then the verb. So the plan is to get Matt to the point where I can eliminate him. Let's see how that plays out. Matt, are you ready? Catch me if you can. Alrighty, let's get this going. <laughs> to eliminate an opponent, you need to catch them off. That'll do it for today's video. If you enjoyed, make sure to smash that like button and hit subscribe. And Matt, thank you so much for joining me today. Cheesecake. <laughs> all, of his, all of his links will be down below in the description. So make sure to check them out. Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next one. Yeah.